Hi, my name is Dean Kamen. I'm the president of DECA Research and Development, and I am the founder of First Inspires. I'm here right now to talk about a couple of different projects. One is this iBot, which is a device that helps the disabled community get around. And the reason I brought it to this conference is I'm hoping that we are going to do for the iBot what vision systems are doing for the automotive industry. We believe that the disabled population, in some ways even more so than a typical driver, could benefit from systems that are watching its environment, making sure we don't slip off a curb or bump into something or run over a child. This device has now been approved by the Food and Drug Administration as a standalone product in the same way that cars are approved. But just as people would like to see cars made more safe, more safe and more useful by adding sensor systems, safety systems, and eventually autonomy, we would like from this embedded vision con uh, conference to become more capable of adding more systems to an iBot to make it more available to more people with disabilities and to make it safer for everybody. I'm also here because the FIRST community is desperately looking for more support from the technical community to give more kids, particularly women and minorities, some of the sense of how exciting science, technology, engineering are. And there's very few things in the world of technology that are more exciting to kids these days than autonomous vehicles and drones and AI. So I'm here with a group of kids from the FIRST community to expose FIRST to more of the developers and more of the manufacturers in the world of embedded vision. And frankly, the embedded vision community probably needs these kids more than these kids need you guys because there's a huge shortage of people with the skills and talents and passions to apply uh, embedded vision in all the places that it could improve products and make the world safer, more efficient, and more fun. I hope you'd be interested in helping FIRST grow and get to more kids. You can go to the FIRST Inspires uh, website and it'll tell you everything you need to know about having a team. We've already got 61,000 schools, but we need more. And you can go to the DECA Research and Development website and see more about this iBot and maybe help us figure out how to add all the vision and sensor systems we need to make the next generation more available for more people.